Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. So uh got on this trail that uh never been on before. Kinda looks like a snowmobile trail to tell you the truth. I'm seeing markers and everything for that, so yeah, there's no more snow, so I feel like I'm safe and not gonna get hit by one. Uh yeah, so I'm out in, uh, not Burlington, uh, Waterford right now. And uh, like I said, never been on this trail. I've uh, tried to, but every time I've ever tried to in wintertime, the trail to get past was always way too icy and uphill, and I never could make it up. <laughs> I've tried. And or it was just way too muddy in the summertime. So, I just stuck around the little trails that were in this uh, little park area. So it's um, pretty cool. A lot of hills uh, where I was at, um, a little bog or uh, wetlands. I had just flown the drone. I was trying to see if I could get a photo. Maybe I did, I'm not really sure with the drone. Uh, did a little B-roll as well to see. Uh, I'm not really sure how it's going to turn out. The lighting right now is not good. It's getting pretty, pretty harsh. But uh, now I'm on the scene or on the lookout for some intimate scenes. Um, yeah, we're going to see how today's going to play out because I'm not really sure what I'm going to encounter today. All right, well, you'll see more, hopefully. Otherwise, this video is gonna be a, a flop or not gonna get released, that's for damn sure. All right, till then. All right, so I got a little scene going on here. Um, I'm probably blurry right now because I have it manually focused to where I'm going to stand. So I got the telephoto on. I did put a polarizer on. It's not really doing much, but I thought maybe I can cut some glare, add a little contrast to it with it, but it's really not doing anything. I'm manually focusing on the tree in the middle where that is focused on. Um, and I, I, I'm gonna be in the middle of the trail. It's gonna be like a self-portrait uh kind of uh, ordeal uh, along the long path with the telephoto it brings everything sucked in basically like the trees are um vignetting the scene um i also have the f-stop at f-16 to try get everything in focus in one shot i'm using my controller to just hold and just keep taking shots because uh well, actually, no, I'm not even holding. I had it set up for just continuous shots um, with timed out everything. Um, it's also on a two second timer, um, manual focus on everything. Um, Yeah, I'm not really sure on how this is really going to work out or how it's going to look. But um, I'm putting myself in the scene to kind of add more depth to the scene. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to turn this on. I got a 20 second delay and I'm going to walk down there. I don't know how much you're going to hear me. This might be way too far for this mic to keep picking up. Um, not really sure on, I think I'm just gonna keep my back to the photo. It's a cool little trail though, for sure. Uh, I just like how the trees that are lined up very, very symmetrically in line with the trail. Excuse me.
This is where I'm focused at. Just gonna stand here for a while. And yeah, let's see how those images turned out. And if you can still hear me, that is gonna be pretty incredible for this wireless mic. And I can see my camera's still shooting. So maybe some of these scenes of me coming back as well will uh, look pretty cool. And just experimenting. Um, is it going to be a great image? I don't know. I don't think so, but uh, it's something for today. Um, I, I really am not sure if this is a private trail or it doesn't look like a private trail to me. And it connected to the trail and it said uh, there's a marker right over there that says. Um, a wildlife area so yeah obviously no hunting or anything even though i see a hunting shack but it could be a just a bird blind as well i don't think it's public though i think over there is uh farmland maybe i'm not a hundred percent sure but uh hopefully i'm not trespassing uh, i would think they'd put a better sign saying no trespassing but yeah, like I said, uh, this is definitely an experiment shot. Um, I do like using the telephoto lens to bring suck everything in together um, for a trail path uh, kind of shot. I think this would be a lot better in fall. Um, I'm definitely going to try to remember this spot for fall time photography. Uh, yeah, with a lot of color, hopefully, which I believe would happen. These kind of look like, um, I'm not really sure what kind of trees. That's like my girlfriend's, uh, <laughs> MO. She tells me every plant everywhere we go. Um, but, uh, yeah, so we'll see how it turns out. You're gonna see it probably right now. So yeah, I'm gonna pack up a little bit and um, it's still kind of early. It's almost getting close to 10 o'clock, but uh, I'm gonna go venture further deep into this trail and see what else I can see. Maybe, uh, maybe something else. We'll see. So I'm not finding anything else on this uh, trail. So I'm making my way back to the vehicle. I'm really kind of hopeful that that shot did kind of turn out to something. I'm not 100% sure on how it's going to really turn out. Looks all right, but we'll see. If anything, I know that in the long run, in a different season like fall, Maybe even summer when everything's green, um, it would look a lot better. Whew, it's very hilly over here. Uh, but hey, 
If anything, like I said, I can definitely make my way back over here and see how it looks and maybe redo the shot. <coughs> so yeah, making my way back to the vehicle to make my way back home. Probably about a four to five mile hike in a very hilly area, which is nice. Oh man, my backpack though, it's very heavy. But I wanted everything just in case. But uh, yeah, I'll see you when I get back to the car. All right, just made it back. Gonna head on home. And if you made it this far, thank you for viewing in. Um, and if you like the video, hit that like button. And if you're into landscape photography or any kind of photography, hit that subscribe button. I appreciate it, and I hope you guys have a great weekend. Till next time, have a good one.